This is Barrett from Rhinestone Alphabets, and you're looking at some of the zebra fonts that I have on my site. These are combo fonts, which means that if you put your caps lock on and type your word, and then take your caps lock off and type the word again, you know, hit enter, uh, you are going to get the bottom half and the top half of the word. And once you separate them, size them, separate them, uh, add color to them, you can move them together instantly to create a really cool font. So this top one is the Athletic Large Zebra and those of you that have purchased this in the past, this is the update. And once you size it as at a 4 in the font box of WinPC and then you go ahead and um, you can convert that to a, a path then I would open up in WinPC 12, open up your transformation and click change to circle. And I also would hit the 13 just to make sure you've got perfect circles for cutting. And then go ahead and group the top half. And then on the bottom half, add a different color so you can kind of visually see what I'm talking about here and then it will move right into the top half perfectly and um, use your arrow key to line it up how you want it but it's it's I would group it if you would feel more comfortable I didn't group it I'm just moving it right in and once I have it where I want it I'll group just that part but um, that gives you an idea of how nicely that lines up this second font here that I have listed is called the um, Zebra Rounded and this is a redo also and it measures uh, well let's check what the outside will measure it measures at about um, 8 inches across and a little over 2 inches and again this works the same way as the font above it is, line, it is um, lined up perfectly, so all you have to do is type it and move it in. And then the final font that I have here is the Zebra 4. And this has got an outline also just like that athletic font, which makes it quite easy to work with. And that size is in the font box at a 3.2. It's a little bit bigger. And again, if you convert that out and go in and change it to circles and double click on it to make sure it's sized, then uh, this comes together quite easily also. So let's add a little color to that and move it in. And you can just see how easy this is to get them ready to go to the cutter. I mean, it's literally seconds. and. Uh, you've got a design that is ready to go. So hope you enjoyed watching that and check out all the combo fonts on my site. I have a ton of them. And thanks for watching.